You are watching Melody Lane. With me, you're gonna have a great crafting time. Well, hello there, everyone. It's Holly with Melody Lane Inspired. And please excuse my voice. I'm getting over being sick. But I wanted to come to you and make sure that you guys knew how, knew how to enter Cricut's new Community Create Challenge. So you might remember back in fall, they did their first Community Create Challenge. And that's where we were all given an image. And then we could create whatever we wanted with the image. What I love about it is we're all using the same images, but like no two projects were the same. It was kind of like a snowflake. And then we would post it in different groups. And then there were winners that won something from Cricut. So this season, we are doing it again. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a tutorial on step-by-step -step how to enter the contest. There were some questions as to last time, so we wanted to make sure everybody knew how to enter. That way you could possibly win a prize. So come along and I will show you how to enter. So first up in the challenges, you are gonna make a project. You are gonna create whatever you like using this image. The image is hashtag M20E11E, and you do not have to use the entire image. So to find that image, just go ahead and go to images when you're on your canvas. And then you are going to want to include the hashtag in there and just type it in. And then this is the image here. This image is going to be free in design space till February 10th. So you can go ahead and add that to the canvas. And you don't have to use the entire image. So you can go ahead and ungroup them and then turn them into individual images. You can use as much or as little as you want. You can go ahead and, and slice and contour them. Just be creative and make with it whatever you like. And then step number two is going to be include a pic of the finished project in your design space project details. So once you open your project, go ahead and hit edit project details. And then right here, we're going to add a photo. So then go ahead and go into your photos and click whichever one you would like to add. And then once you finish that, you're going to want to make sure that you do save it. That way the photo is uploaded. And then just to show here is what I created with the image from the community create challenge. I have here, can we see it? So this is a lenticular card. So I took the hearts from it. I went ahead and ungrouped and used the hearts. And then I made, I made the beating hearts card for the outside of the card. Isn't that fun? I'm like a child. I mean, as you can tell by the unicorns and the rainbows in the background. So anything that, go ahead and show you here. I love anything fun interactive or that's like, ooh, that's special. Isn't that fun? So just with taking those hearts and some slicing, I created the Beating Hearts Lenticular card. And then step number three is going to be make your project public in Design Space, and you want to add the tag Community Create Challenge. So you just go down here on the tags and then do Community Create Challenge, and that's going to be all one word. And then the tag is going to pop up there. You can click on it and then go ahead and save that also. And number four is only use Cricut fonts and images in the design and no uploaded images. If you're an Access member, you are going to get tons of options to choose from in images and fonts. If you are not, you can choose free images or you can go ahead and purchase them a la carte if you like. Or it'd be a great time to go ahead and sign up for Cricut Access because who doesn't want access to hundreds of thousand images and all these fonts? Now, once you've completed these four steps, you're automatically going to be entered in to Cricut's entry. So you get one entry in theirs, which they will pick a winner from them. And then the rest of the winners will come from different Facebook groups. Next, you're going to go ahead and share your project link in Cricut Design Space group on Facebook with the hashtag community create challenge. So to do this, go ahead and click the share arrow there, and then you can go ahead and copy the link. And then you're going to want to take that link over to your Facebook group. And this here is the Cricut Design Space group, the Cricut Design Space with Melody Lane. So click to make a post, and then you're just going to go ahead and paste that link there. And then you're going to want to type the hashtag community create challenge, and then post that to the group. And those are all the steps to enter. And then a few things to note. So the contest is open from January 24th through February 7th. You can enter as many Facebook groups as you want, but each entry in it must be unique. So no duplicate posting of projects. And then you can only enter once in each of the different Facebook groups. Now there is going to be a blog on Cricut's page that will take you where it has all the different info and it will have all of the different Facebook groups that you can enter. So I hope you guys have fun with this. I'm excited to see what everyone does with it. Everybody has a different idea and I love to see that. 
In the links of the video description, you will find a link to our Facebook group, Cricut Design Space, and you will also find a link to the blog post on Cricut that gives the rest of the other groups that you can enter in. And then what do you win? Well, one winner from each of the groups, and then the one that Cricut chooses from Design Space, are going to win a Joy Bundle! Yay! And then you could also win our Melody Lane Cricut monthly giveaway that is currently going on. And this is only open until the 27th, so you want to enter soon. But this month, four different winners are going to win $125 to spend at Cricut to get whatever their crafting heart desires. So links for that will also be in the video description below. We wish you guys all good luck. We can't wait to see the projects. Let's have some fun with this, everyone. And we always want to show our gratitude and thank you so much to our amazing admins, our supporters, and our sponsors. We hope you all have a wonderful rest of the week. Happy crafting, everyone. Bye.